Okay, now we're very close to finishing loading. Only a second. Well, the thing is starting up, doing some final mod management. Dum. Dum. Yeah, waiting for. So. First of all, I'm going to give a shout out for everyone. Hi Mizen, hi Supermanix, hi Ty Jr., hi John. Oh wow, broke again by Terraforge. That, they did some stuff in the last updates, didn't they? Hi Pokey, how are you doing? Um, hi Irish Chef, how are you? And ah, neat, your motherboard is going to arrive. That's That's good news, I would say, definitely. Okay, multiplayer, I'm going to hide this quickly so I can give them my credentials, password, password, one, two, three, <laughs> and we're going online. I did um, do a bunch of exciting commits today, yes, um, we fixed a bunch of things around the builder a bunch of things around the crafters, etc. So a lot of the things uh, should be better. No, I don't set it to remember my password because it stores it as clear text. 
and that is a clear security issue. I definitely, as a security researcher, can't do. Um, and hi Gia as well, how are you doing? Yeah, I sent your PR to Orion to get that that one sorted out and merged as soon as possible. And I still uh, I had a lot of C++ stuff today and important bug fixes. Tomorrow I'm going to test out your version. I got that on the top of my list already. The new version is 13.21.1 instead of 13.22 because the build system is down and I had to I had to take care of that. Um, so because the build system is going to come on soon again, soon again, the build system is going to produce the 3022. And just to avoid me having two 22 versions, I just made an intermediate version so that these things are not going to conflict. Yeah, I kind of, kind of am afraid of that happening as well. I was was avoiding to know too much about C++ to avoid possibly getting a job around it but now everyone is going to see my github commits and might hire me for it and we're like oh no <laughs> what happened again are you kidding me died again our builder incredible yeah, that that sounds about right. <laughs> Cinnamon and yeah, he survived only one episode. I don't remember his name clearly. Oh wow, the university seems. I think it's it's ready actually. Oh, that's neat. Um, we just don't have a worker here yet, but let's check out how the university turned out. We got here a little library room. Check out the other rooms. Get here a little research room for something. Get here another room with rabbits. Um, and some other things. It seems like crop research room. And here, general working research room. And then you got the main room with the staircase up here. Where we have the universe. What do you have to show me, Wizzy? Ah, short leg spike. That's client side though. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Where's Wizzy? What does he have to show me? Yes, Wizzy? What do you have to show me? Okay. Nether portal, ender portal. Skelly farm and zombie farm. Do we have that now? Okay. I'm following you, I'm following you. Zombie farm, wide road. Okay. Ah, chunks. Okay, I'm coming. So, Wizzy been busy. Wizzy been busy, I see. Around the corner. Yes, it will. It will roll back probably every time. Oh, I can I can hear it. Oh, neat. We we have to station a a archer here or a knight to to level them up. <laughs> oh, I thought one of our citizens just got killed. I was like, oh no. Okay, it was not a good thing. Oh, hi, Ar Margo as well. Haven't 
seen you sneaking in. I guess there's another one further down now. Let, let's check out that one. It's actually nice because if it breaks, we can actually blame Wizzy for once. Rightfully. <laughs> Not like it's less rightfully when we usually do it. But it's now even more rightfully so, I would say. Still waiting for some add-ons to come on. He's still doing some deafing for the new tavern update. Okay. Ah, neat. So we got here the other spawner. Oh, wow. How many bones and stuff are in here? And wither skeletons and coal. Oh, wow. It's kind of OP, man. <laughs> B b blame Wizzy for this being absolutely OP. <laughs> what is OP? Uh, Wizzy <laughs> set up a uh, skeleton and zombie farm. And there's like a ton of stuff in there. Upstairs? More upstairs? Sounds OP. Okay, I'm coming. Um, yeah, like we announced, we do have some plans to make the general hiring process more efficient. Okay. Kelly Farmer Kill Zone. Ah, that has been... That's where the skellies come from. Oh, interesting. Um, I think probably some add-ons is going to be even better at explaining. Oh wow, that's one of the underground places. This looks neat. There's an end portal. Where is the end portal? Okay. <laughs> But in, in general, the idea is to have the tavern a place where you hire, rec where you recruit citizens. Like before, there's this recruitment button in the in a town hall, and then magically a citizen appears, which is let's say very far from immersive. So when you place it on the tavern now, in the future, with that upcoming update, um, these citizens are going to spawn in the tavern here and there. And they're going to have different stats and different stories they're going to tell you. And they can be hired then. Oops. Yeah, just like that. <coughs> Basically that. Different costs, like some books, some inner, some uh, quartz or so. Yes, exactly. Gold. And the or portal this way. Potatoes. Yeah, he, he published the development spoilers. Um, yeah, they were they're going to tell, like, they have a, was it really so close? Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah, we do have an end portal right on our base. Are you serious? Yeah, we got one right on our base. How like, how likely is that, please? How likely is that? That is so unlikely. <laughs> oh yeah, I know. I'm I'm here for the bookshelves. <laughs> I'm not here for exploring. I'm here for the books. <laughs> This stuff is going to be super great because we don't need almost any cows for this. Yeah. Ah! What was this? 
Okay. Are you stealing books again? I'm stealing books from the library, obviously, obviously. <laughs> stealing books from the library, what, what kind of professor are you going to be? <laughs> <laughs> the professor that's going to lend books at the library and never bring them back, what did you think, what kind of professor? Hi Captain Salt, how are you being? How is your computer going? Did you get your pieces finally? Close to it? Yes. I like the book so much, I'm going to keep them. And you know what, I'm not only going to get the books, I'm going to get entire shelves. But not only the shelves with three books in them. Even though it seems like they have 20. Only three you're getting out of it. I'm going to try that. Break a shelf and I'm going to wonder. Hey, why are there 50 f books on the floor? It had only... Usually it only drops three. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Welcome to the Patreon world, Captain. Um, if you PM me on Discord, I can set up your your Patreon perms on Discord as well then. And hi Tiny Tots as well, how are you doing? And welcome to Cesareo, to God Milk, no I don't. Hi Mythical Monty, and hi Portal Apprentice as well. Thanks and welcome to our channel. We're having a lot of fun with destroying libraries and mine colonies. And letters in general as well. No, not the letters. <laughs> <laughs> um, there we By go. By the way, the vending wing stuff I did earlier wasn't for my tavern stuff. It wasn't? It was for... No, it's for the status icons. Ah. So when you hover so, the status icons, it's going it to tell you what the problem is. So people are confused. Yeah. Ah, that's a good idea, actually. Um, yes, it's okay to leave the bone wheel without it. That's why they say in the message that they c they would be better with bone meal, but they don't say I need bone meal to work. So. They're going to be fairly quick if you give them bone meal, but in general they don't actually need it. Uh, sure, oops. Sh sure it's the flu and not corona. I mean, the entire colony got the flu, it might be corona actually. Ah! There's so many infested stuff things. It's insane. Die! Die! Ah! Yeah, it's considered an axe and a sword. It's something from this mod that does these kinds of things. <laughs> Um, let me drop. I can hear you. Um, don't I have some iron here with me so I can repair it? Because the walk back is. Ah, here there's one. Great. Iron. Oh, that's not a lot. Another two irons. I'm going to repair it further. There we go. Um, your suggestion on GitHub? I'm not entirely sure. What was your suggestion on GitHub? I might have not read it, but if you tell me now about it, I might give you feedback about it right now. It's because if people post it in the in the suggested feature channel, I actually don't have to read it, and only when I am like, oh, I, n I think I need a new feature to implement, then I can check through them and see if there's anything small I could do. 
Um, I'm not sure if the uh, builder using items has been fixed. It might be less, but I wasn't able to fully reproduce it yet. So I got that issue and I fixed it and it stopped appearing after that. However, I'm not 100% sure if it's fixed already. That's one of the next things I'm going to be focusing on over the next weeks or still. If I repair it in the anvil, it's better. Okay, I'm going to do that in the future then. Yeah, GitHub is the best. There's a planned and suggested feature tab on GitHub. An issue exactly for that. And all suggestions should go there. Because that's the main place where we fuel them from, I would say. Although we all have relatively big lists of issues we are going to work on in the new future already anyway. So, until that... Either you're lucky <laughs> and your suggestion is exactly in that list. Ah, die. Or it might take a little bit longer until we get that. Yeah, that is actually not so easy because then we would... Like we have some general ideas about that we want the... A digger worker in the future and that is going to do all the digging like you can still have the builder have the digging but in generally the digger worker is going to do it but with the lumberjack it might be it's probably a neat idea but no it's not probably it's a neat idea but it's difficult to do because it's very difficult and costly to check if something is a tree like at the moment we check if something is a tree on a different thread exactly to avoid that cost and hi Strutala, how are you doing Welcome to our chat. You're a little bit late today, though. We're already entire 22 minutes in. Been minding books for around 15 of them. <laughs> Hi, John Fall as well. Welcome to the stream. We're almost finished. We're almost through here. Getting those here for string. String is good. We need a bunch of it. Oh, there's some here that I forgot. Um, ah, I'm falling down here. There may be some stuff up there missing that I overlooked. No, it seems fine. We're not lucky enough to have two libraries, right? <laughs> that happens. Super rare, but it... Wait, there's another one, isn't there? I saw another one, I thought. No. 20. Because... Oh, our other builder died again, some add-ons, by the way. Yeah, I know. How did this happen? I go offline and our builders die. Mm, he died uh, when I logged on yesterday. Yeah. Basically, after logging on, he was already dead. So, <laughs> and I, I guess... I finally saved our second builder. <laughs> and I guess none of uh, the floating carpet could be saved. I went where he died and there was one, so... Yeah. Not sure. Is it... Dark yeah, especially for that reason, <laughs> I go where he died. But I saw that our library is finally finished, so that's some good news there at least. I'm going yeah. back. Oh, too much creepers. I'm going to need those books because I am so scared from the university upgrades after all that Sean told me. So, <laughs> I'm making sure to have everything I need for that. Huh? Is there anything up here? Now Wizzy cleaned it out. Oh, there we go. Hi, Eda Fixer. <laughs> How are you doing? Welcome to our stream as well. 
Oh, you're a subscriber as well. Very nice. Um, I just I gotta find a way out here now. Eh. That's a library I cut down. Well, there's some stairs up here. That lead nowhere. Okay. Some stairs down here. Wizzy has been really diligent here. Wait. Guess it's not down here because that's not where I came from. So that's, there's some interesting more rooms I think Wizzy might not have visited down here. And because there's nothing to visit. There's some coal ore. I'm going to take that one with me. Wait, if we can go kill the Ender Dragon. Did the Ender Dragon respawn? I'm not sure. Oh, because but then it's we need it's an, an amazing fight. Oh, it's going to be just taunting. How amazing this fight is going to be. Just like the Ocean Monument, which was so interesting. <laughs> oh, you, th you thought they... Back to Ocean Monument. Good to say it. Like there's I there's so many things Mojang is objectively bad at, but I think end boss fights might be actually the thing they're worst at. Yeah. Uh, how do I get out of here? I'm totally lost. I think that's where I came from. Uh, here, here. Upstairs. Great. Um Ow. Hey. hey. <laughs> so where where is it out the way out here? Yeah. Okay. Someone no. saved me. This way. Oh. We got no button. That's bad. No cheating. <laughs> this day. <laughs> Yeah, but we don't have the ender pearls for that one. Not yet, yeah. Ah, here is the way out, great. What's the problem with your guard tower, Mergo? Is it a dark oak guard tower that needs prismarine? Oh yeah, I, I heard that there is a magic Sam here on the server that gives out free prismarine lanterns for people that need it for the level 2 guard towers. <laughs> <laughs> I think I gave Gods one. Yeah. What's what's your in-game name again, Margo? Are you are you online, by the way? Before asking your in-game name, um, jumping. But I got too much stuff now. Do we have like a way I can just dump dump all my stuff somewhere? No, you can throw it all in the lava. Eh, no, it's kind of good stuff. If you right click. Twice on our draw controller here, it inserts all items which are already sorted in. Yeah, only those. Let me. I do have some yeah. burge logs here. I'm going to make. Um, me. I need more than that though. I'm going to make a craft. Where here? I'm going to make one chest. Just um, 27. Here, one chest. We have more birch, pl more birch planks. Very good. Second chest. Ah, wait. I can't put those books, I guess, somewhere. What is the limit? 
I have to put it again and again, right? Okay. Okay, that, that is at least something should be usefully sorting in here. There we go. That's a neat amount of books, isn't it? Yeah, we would have to create new... the new Ender Dragon stuff then, yes. Um, cave fruit. I'm a bit hungry. I'm going to eat that. That's one less thing to dump. Leather cap and leather boots. I guess going to be useful for our workers. Then there's this stuffy stuff here. Acacia saplings, sugar cane. Those are useful. That's useless. What do I want to get rid? This stuff, this stuff, this stuff. How much can I get put like in here? Oh, that was a neat quantity actually. Are all the upper thing, uh, upper drawers connected to it too now? Yeah. Oh, neat. Connect, so. That's good. That's good yeah. to know. It's quite useful. Oh. Another one for our second second uh, supply can. Do we have one there too? Not yet. Uh, what else can I dump here? I think that's fine. No, most of the blocks here should be okay-ish. Um, what else? I'm going to take one of these. Yes, that worked. Let me sort in a few of those things here. Okay, now I'm going to do the other one. Yeah, it might just be enough for the Jedi library, but they're probably not guaranteed. Um, so that stuff. We have a lot of these soul gems, I see. We have them all over the place. Yeah, I'm not sure what they are even for. Um, in here, there, okay. I'm going to dump this, this, and this, those, and this. Okay, now we got a clean inventory. Now we can get start. <laughs> Yeah, I got a bunch of sandstone. Definitely. That's a good thing to have always. Um, yes, we are already working on 116, but no ETA at all yet for it. Just waiting mainly for forge mappings. As far as I heard, there's a way to pre-compile the existing mappings. So I can... There is someone made a tool for it. Oh, we're also missing guards here. There's no guard in this one. Yeah, uh, one guard and one bizarre type. What are we building here? That is... Shepherd's hut. I'm going to build that one already. Ah, it's already... I guess the builder died building that then. The other one I see a guard assigned. Um, yeah. Are we not getting any new childs? What's it today then? Oh, we do have new childs, but they don't have food. Ah, uh, they're not growing up. Eh. Yeah. That's they are all at home starving. <laughs> Great. But does this tell us we need a cook urgently? Yeah, yeah, that's why I already placed an Olaf one. Okay. Um, let me get some iron and melt my iron down so I can give the guard a sh oh, Ah, we don't it. have the shield research yet, right? Not yet. So it's not worth not it yet. yet researching the. giving the guard a shield? just for him to lose it. Um, let me just melt down a little bit of the iron I found here. 
Iron and silver potentially. Iron and silver. Put the mutton here. Great. Then I'm going to check on our other builder. Everly, I think was her name. Ah, you finally got out to add the recipes. Yeah, that's farther, rather useful. Um, you can add recipes via data packs relatively easily nowadays. Are you kidding me? Everly is also dead. Me? Who killed Everly? El why are you having a carved pumpkin suspender? Ah, it's going to put it on. I'm Good. not sure. <laughs> Good thing that I have already a mask on. And good thing you still didn't learn that you can put a pressure plate in front of a dispenser, some add-ons. What? Why not? Because then that there's a block in front of the dispenser and it can't put anything there. It doesn't work like that. Why not? It's, it's not a full block. Just yeah, but <laughs> we know, we know Mojang. But I already had a my Enderman hat on, fortunately. Else it would be just horrible. Who came up with this shit? Awesomeness came up with it, right? Didn't he? <laughs> so our j like our. Ex where are these children? I'm going to tell them to grow up. It's kind of dark in here, isn't it? Do I have some coal with me? Like wool? No coal. Let me get some coal quickly. And I'm going to get some rubies to repair my pickaxe too. Rubies? Which of them was a ruby again? We have four childs and none of them was fed. I. Which one is a ruby? Was this here the ruby? No, that's Alexandrite. How do I see what's inside in the drawer? Is there no item icon that renders open it? Um. Yeah, I'm shifting. I'm shifting all of it already. What's this? Carnelian, limestone, something. I think none of this is ruby, is it? Iolite, Jasper. Um. I guess none of it. Oh, maybe is this your ruby? No, ten centimeter, something. Um. Anyone knows if anything of this here looks like ruby? Please shout out. I'm. I'm just lost. I don't know which one of these might be ruby. Maybe a diamond. Can I fix it with a diamond? Okay, that works. <laughs> Upper right here. Okay, how had yeah, let me Ruby. Ah, it's that one here. Not that one, it's that one. So and is any one of these here? I think none of them is a ruby to be honest. We're missing a ruby yet. But the diamond worked, so that's fine. Um is there a way to put looting on on these tools by the way do you know um, that you can enchant them yes ah, it's normal enchantment yeah. so I need s some more levels I guess and I think some of the materials do have similar 
Great. So I'm going to the nether. I'm going to mine a little bit. And I'm going to get a little bit of of leveling, of levels. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah, I need some coal to make a torch. But now I'm here already. Hmm. Lava. Holds. Not the friendliest environment here, I guess. Let me go down here. I guess it's safer than falling from up there. I heard there's a bunch of pigmen that attack you when they see you mining as well. Although we did turn it off, I think, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Okay, that's great. Ouch. But you can just kill them. Here, nether iron ore. As ah, so there's a bunch of ores now here in the nether. Ow! Fire flowers, okay. Ah, nether quartz, there we got it. So that's how it looks like, okay. Now, now I'm prepared. Now I know what I have to look for, actually. Um, dum de dum. That looks like more of it. Yes, great. Okay. Sorry, hound. You're making very dangerous noises. And I really don't want to risk anything. I really don't like those bramble blocks. Those kind of look dangerous as well. But I definitely like how Biomes of Plenty makes the nether a little bit more interesting. Some iron ore, then we work our way around here. Yeah, I kind of, kind of don't get why don't they call it just a hellhound? That would be much more fitting for the nether, I think. Oh, neat, we got some torches. Oh, that is so much better, I can see something. Oh, thanks, nether ores. The stream is running. <laughs> I did announce it. I did. I even did an at updates for it. Didn't I propagate it to this? Let me just double check for that. Didn't I? Did I cl forget clicking? No. Should it? Ah! Again? Put me on fire? It's not nice. I did. I did announce it. I blame Wizzy for not seeing it. And I think I can do so very, very rightfully. Oh, black diamond ore? Oh, that's... Wow, the durability of that is almost off the charts. All mine. All mine. I'm going to make black diamond tools. I guess that's why they attack you, because the blocks you can get in the nether are pretty good. Sikran ore, crimson iron. There's a bunch of stuff here, definitely. Oh, nether lapis. Okay. I get out of it. Meow. Let me just reopen the chat. 
Yeah, it was part of the general announcement and it propagated in all directions. So there's no excuse, Mr. Wizzy. No excuse whatsoever to be missing our stream. Oh, even Nether Emerald Ore. Okay, I'm, I might be thinking about telling Wizzy to turn on the aggressive <laughs> mod mobs again. It was fun. I liked it. Eh, <laughs> hey, because it's kind of there's so many ores in the Nether. Yeah, and the big man's was a little challenge. <laughs> Everyone, no, don't do it. Come on, don't you it's think it's a little bit overpowered, people? Yeah, it's like me asking earlier, hey, mobs are too easy here, shouldn't we add some difficulty mod? And I, oh, everyone is like, no! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not going to turn that on, I'm going to have pirates spawn in lava seas then. <laughs> When we detect you mining the nether, poisonous tomato potato. Okay. So we're getting somewhere. Yeah, the problem is the amount of pigment actually. I also agree. I think I find it fine when you mine in the nether and you get a pigment. Because the amount of ores there is here is a lot and there is literally no danger or almost no danger let's go let's say that um need to get up here um what is this flesh really that sounds disgusting uh, crimson iron. Okay, I'm going to get that as well. Um, nothing up here. I think we can go back down. Besides the flesh. Oh wow. Yeah, at least John. I know I can count on John. Because he also agrees that this is too OP. So maybe. Is it like a middle setting? Like. Only one attacks you or so. Yeah, and my builder is dead. Yeah, I've heard that there is some kind of I don't know what it what it is causing. Have you heard that as well, some addons? What cursing? Add like workers all workers stop moving or so on the server uh, I'm getting oh, yeah, that's normal. normal yeah normal why that should not be normal uh, it happens when all four movement sweats run into issues and shut down all four uh, <laughs> how can that happen some add-ins well, should... some blocks were weird like Special play. <laughs> so I guess that's a performance bug. I fixed that one. Okay, okay. I'm glad it's not a mine colonies bug. So we blame we we blame some addons for it, and you can't blame me. And you you can blame Wizzy after all. That is that's always viable. But you can't blame me. That that's what matters for me <laughs> at least. <laughs> I got enough stuff on my blade already that I'm blaming myself for. There's not a. That's enough. No need for additional blame. Yeah, I heard that the builder is still eating eating items. Strothaler told me that as well. He's been doing some testing locally. Maybe he found a way to reproduce it. He sent me a relatively big message. I'm going to be checking out after the stream, and maybe it leads to something. He's working on the latest release version and always in single player. Um, maybe he will find a way for me to reproduce it. And as my slogan goes, I reproduced it, I found it, I fixed it. It, it literally is that. 
90% of the time I spent solving a bug is trying to find a way to reproduce it. After a bug is reproduced, it's usually relatively simple to make at least a, f a fix for that. Ah, okay. Items didn't get lost. So he's playing in single player. And I guess you don't have any additional mods either, right? Um, some lapis, that's neat. That get also gives experience. Okay. Okay, um, I'm going to fill in that. I'm going to wait for the lava to retrieve a little bit. So we can go out here. Get some more stuff here. Okay. So we're going to bridge. Um, okay. Yeah, so there... I have a strong feeling that what is causing this loss of items is some kind of mod incompatibility. I have a very strong feeling about that. Um, however, I could not pinpoint it yet. It's very weird because it's something that does not happen if you have only mine colonies installed, basically. Or at least... I couldn't reproduce it yet. Like, I was able to reproduce a little back, like I said. Where thousands of items got lost. Which was because the builder picked up more than a stack. And I think that might be fixed. However, I couldn't, for the love of it, reproduce it. Without after that, after I fixed that, it wouldn't happen anymore. And it's, it's because if there's a stack over 64, on a restart, that gets resetted. Right? Um, here we go. It would get reset to 64. However, it's also happening with less than 64 items, right? So it makes it kind of difficult. I, I'm totally lost. I'm so lost. <laughs> I just continue mining and hope I'm going to find a way back after that. There's some stuff down here. You do know that you can teleport back, right? Yeah, I got a teleport. In the, in the worst case, I got a teleport. And yes, the bad stacking should not happen anymore either. Boren or... <coughs> Those seems so... There's so many around here. Why am I seeing like 50 mobs on my mini map? Do we have some weight? No. Dum -de -dum. No, I totally forgot to set a waypoint at the nether portal. I'm just using my general sense of direction then. We're going to see how where dad is going to lead us. <laughs> and I'm getting farther and farther away from the portal. That one that one I know for sure. But it's actually usually I'm relatively good in in at um, finding my way. Like in real life I usually only need one little look at the map. And I'm going to find back and there again without a problem. However, in Minecraft, I sometimes tend to relying too much on the tools. And then I kind of forget to focus on the path. And then I get lost. Um, yeah, it's because I... It's like, I'm fine with that. But if someone takes me somewhere and I'm not paying attention, I also don't find my way back, usually. Um, so I have to pay attention for that skill to work. Um, 
So that's in Minecraft, it's kind of, it's not like I'm going to be spending a lot of... What is this? Rose? So I found, yeah. I'm going to get some extra levels, just in case. Because I do know that always I'm going to need to enchant a bunch of things before I get the Fortune 3 enchantment. Okay, there we go. More of this boring ore. Um, dum -de -dum. Oops. Okay. My screen just... My stream... What is happening? Okay. I think some screen failures here in the middle. That's some iron ore. Definitely worth it. Um, okay. Um, I know it was in this direction. Next to this lava. And then it was here. And we go downwards. In this direction. And then I got to go downwards here. Okay. And then and now I'm not entirely sure. I think it's further down. And then not here, no. Not here. Nor here. That actually seems pretty much like the room, doesn't it? Um. Wasn't it around here? No, that seems totally off. I'm in the wrong direction for sure. Or is it? I kind of feel like I was coming from here. Okay, I'm teleporting back. <laughs> Death colony, there we go. That's easier. I'm back. You just tell me your in-game name, Margo, and I can... I can magically give you one. I press marine block. There we go. Mm -hmm. I'm the only one sleeping. Let's see. Yes, very good. Kaislin, okay. And um, give. Kaislin, that was Prismarine. What's the name of it? Prismarine what? Prismarine. Isn't it Lantern? It's Key Lantern. Minecraft Lantern, isn't it? No, that's the wrong one. <laughs> or is it? No, that's the wrong one. <laughs> what was the name of the Sea Lantern? Sea... There it is. There we got it. It's only a question of... Time. <laughs> Yeah, that, w that one is bugged. Um, Kugo already fixed it, I think. So it only needs to be scanned in and uploaded. And we're going to have that one fixed, fortunately. Um, dum -de dum 
Can we hire a new builder? Nope. We got a bunch of ores and stuff. You see Lapis. Then this weird thing here. <laughs> no, please, no letters for me. <laughs> Fine, and you get no letters. <laughs> Um, can I plant that here? No. Okay. Um, I, I think I can deposit a lot of that stuff and put the other things here to smelt. Great. Progress is being made. We need a new slot for the nether rack I guess and do an add here too um, and the boron ore there we go and put one of these in here too yeah here there we go Oh yeah, the tavern torches, definitely. I kind of heard... Here it's fine, down here it's fine. Hey, oh wow, very nice Captain Salt. Thanks for the additional subscription. We appreciate a lot. Every subscription helps. <laughs> what is missing a door here? We get some spruce wood to make another door. It's kind of dangerous. Um, <laughs> upstairs is spruce. To find out which one is the spruce again. I think it was this one, wasn't it? Spruce. You have a door here. There we go. And door fixed. And our kids are still not grown up, right? <laughs> yes, yeah, they're not. Uh, oh, this reminds me, I wanted to give them some more food. Um, <laughs> I can't even see the kids, where are they running around? Can see, I see, can see a guard here. Oh, I'm sick. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Want me to kill it? <laughs> okay, that one is kinda hungry as well. Yeah, giving him some. And one is sick, you said? Yeah, sick and starving. <laughs> Carrot and potato you want, okay. I'm going to bring it. Yeah, we should have. If that is not realistic, what else is? Poor guy there. Not living the life, the other the friends are running and playing around outside. That sucks. Oh. Um, Not like it's a stuck down here. Do we have the... Um, I can't find any... At least not here. Carrot and potato. No carrot and potato here. A carrot I found. Just potato I didn't. But we have a potato farmer, don't we? No, but we got a potato field behind our supply camp. Okay, that's good enough, I guess. <laughs> um, getting some potatoes. I made one because we always need a constant supply of potatoes. Yes. Constant supply of potato is an important one. 
And we are playing the Mindcony's official pack. I don't even have to leave the stream for that. It's mod pack here. That's the one we're playing. Um, dum -de -dum, healing the sick child. <laughs> I'll work on it. There you go. The music is going to start playing. Ding, ding, ding. There we go. Need to put those in my backpack. Kind of always good to have one of these cures with you. you walk around in the colony. Meanwhile, we can already see what are we going to need for our first research. And I think the first research is going to be shields for guards, probably. Oh yeah, wait, no, the restaurant. Awesome. Maybe the restaurant first. Oops. Oh, we have to unlock our restaurant. I think it was, wasn't it? Civilian. Whose idea was that? No, restaurant not. Uh, hospital yeah. we have to unlock. Ah, yeah, that's fine. So, okay. Um. Or do you want it sleeping less, actually? I think first the sh shield and then sleeping less. Okay. Mm, maybe even town first before sleeping less. Yeah, but it's... Do we have... Uh, we should have most of the meat for that. But it's yeah, 25 yeah. only and it's a one hour research so that... I guess first I'm going, yeah, ah, yeah, first shield though. I was melting some iron here, so we should have enough for that now. We also wanted to unlock our stonemason. Ah, yes, we want the stonemason unlocked relatively soon too. Three of it, exactly. Taking some additional ones. Now I can actually start thinking about enchanting this tool here. But first I want to fix it. 1.1k, fully fixed. Then I go on the other one to actually enchant it. I guess... What is this? Ah, this is a disenchanter. I need some lapis first though. Lapis... here. <laughs> Good night, Captain Salt. Have a good one. I hope your PC is going to arrive soon. Or your final parts. Okay. That's efficiency 4. That we don't want. So I'm just going to... Um, mine this block here. I'm going to place it somewhere else. I'm going to just enchant a book. Let me get some books quickly. Let me just put some garbage enchantments on the books first. Um, here. Until we get this. Although I'm only... Why am I only level 31? I was level 33. Didn't do anything. Oh, it some levels. What? Cost levels? T I don't know. Ah. Hate. <laughs> I hope they have fortune 3 now there, else I have to go somewhere else again. Silk touch. Good? Not good enough. Oh nice, we got some nice ender pearls. So I'm going to go back to the nether, and this time I'm going to pay attention where I'm actually walking. <laughs> um, I promise. Okay. So we go downstairs. Wait, wait. No, I'm not. I'm on. Yeah, 
Okay, I'm going to put a waste on. Home. And yes, I know there's a missing O, but my keyboard doesn't like me. Let's say it like that. Color. That's experience for me. You're waiting for me to fall off in the lava? That's that's not a very nice thing to wait for, you know that? It's kinda mean, Anonymous. Um. Dum de dum. Oh neat, there's a way up here. Someone made. I made an achievement. Mm -hmm. Oh, black diamond ore. That, ah, I thought I was falling down now. <laughs> no, it's because my keyboard is having fun with the O key lately. So when you don't see me writing the O or V key, it's the keyboard. All our other typ typos, you can blame Wissy for them. No, at the moment there's no public mine colony servers besides the not very supported 114 one. Uh... Get my sword here. There we go. Okay, let's put some of those here again, better. And I did see... Oh, some little lapis, okay. More XP. There we go. Another coal. Yeah, the problem is this is a laptop, so I just can't easily switch it. And I don't really have the money to buy a keyboard, a new keyboard, to use alongside either. Mm, you should be able to switch single keys. Mm. Not, not as easily, not without potentially breaking it. Yeah, but a, a crappy keyboard is like 10 euros. I'm... I'm writing all day long code. So a crappy keyboard is... I prefer not having a... the O key then. <laughs> okay, gotta reload it. And 10 euros is still a lot of money. <laughs> and go fund me campaign for race keyboard. <laughs> um, there we go, up, up again. Did I jump down here? Oh, one shot go up. No, it came from the other side, didn't I? Oh, one side grew up. Again? Nah. <laughs> of course not. Oh, one child grew up, so we got a builder finally, I guess. Yeah. No, I didn't. I'm back on the track. I know where I came from, I came from this direction. 
I'm gonna put a torch there to remind myself of that too. <laughs> ah, dum de dum. Hey, doing a PhD without a scholarship is not easy. I was like super unlucky as well. Because it's kinda... In general in my area it's not so easy to not get a scholarship for your PhD. However, if you're lucky enough to be like some random border case of making a PhD in a country which is not your home country and then you decide on top of that to make a double degree with another country that is near, not your own country you can't apply for a scholarship in either of the two countries because you're not a full time a full only student for that institution and nor a permanent resident of the country isn't that like <laughs> great yes that is that is just great that is like such a random border case that probably no one ever thought about making something better for those few students or people who thought of baking something got it rejected because it like uh, those few border cases are are two border case and might open up abuse on another side so we prefer not having it So yeah, I do hope that my prof finds a way to get my tuition paid because that one is already, that would just make me badly broke <laughs> if I had to, I have to pay the tuition of the next semester. Yeah. I got another one year and a half to go of my PhD and then I finally can get a job that pays me actual money. Sets postdoc scholarships are usually also pretty decent. So that's also a solution for that. This direction we came from. Them. Ah, nice. I think that's the last one, and then we try to find a way back again. I hear they hear some weird breaking noise, but my tool actually not br didn't break. It's kind of weird. I don't need any waypoint. I can find my way home without any waypoint. This time at least. <laughs> at least this time. This time I paid attention where I'm walking. There we go. Yay. No, and now I'm back already, basically. Dum -de -dum. I sometimes confuse those plants with actual ores in the walls. <laughs> yeah, the nether sounds already making me super paranoid. Imagine if you're yourself in the nether. I don't want to imagine that.
What did you do with the nether portals and items? Nothing. Nothing? I see the obsidian <laughs> here in the wall. That's our ender portal. What a lie. And it's our nether portal. What a lie. So items just came there just yeah. to hide the ender portal. I don't believe it. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? <laughs> it was like this since... Oh no, forever. Since since forever, since <laughs> one minute ago that I snuck since I snuck into the nether. <laughs> okay. Let me just double click the stuff again into the drawers. Another kid grew up I just saw. Or is that yeah. the first kid? No, another. Oh neat. Oh, diamond ore. Did you find some? Yeah. Ah, nice. Okay, I'm going to hire the second builder. And we're full of builders. I know I'm going to hire a guard, probably. I know. Or. Nah, another builder. Yeah, both. We have two. Childs. Now we have two childs. Didn't you hire any yet? No. So you can, should be able to hire both. No, only one violet here. Mm. Okay, you need those. We get. Do I? I don't have any logs <sighs> with me anymore. Here, jungle logs. Um, and some cactus stuff too. I can use the jungle logs. I deposited all the other stuff. Okay. Sandstone, I got. I can help you with that. Dirt, I got. No, I don't have dirt. So I'm going to get some dirt. And I'm going to get some cactus and I'm going to get some coal back. That was you, Solmus. It was not some Adams. That was such a some Adams, Adams move, though. Always blaming me. <laughs> I think that's usually like a safe bet. <laughs> it's like the boy cr that cried wolf. It's like you it just know. Um, this gives additional experience. Yes. Yeah, we definitely need a smelter in general. Um, what else did I want? I wanted to get some cactus. We got some cactus growing. Don't we have any cactus? Ah, there, I found it. Never mind. Never turn off cactus. There we go. Planting the cactus back. There we go. What else did I say I'm going to bring to the builder? Cactus. Torches. I think that's what it that was it. Can the rabbit hutch create rabbit foot? Uncertain. How do you create a rabbit foot? That you get that from killing rabbits, don't you? Yeah. Then the rabbit hat can get rabbit foot. <laughs> um, how many? No, there is no way to see how much empty slots the warehouse has. Although that should be relatively easy to add, to be honest. Since we got the slots um, tracked in each rack, how many slots are empty, that should be pretty performant to add and sync to the client as well, to the GUI. That should be easy. You don't even need to sync it. Client can just calculate it itself. But we don't have the map on the client side. The map from the rack. Don't Do we have that synced? I'm unsure. Mm, no, but it's a tile entity, so it knows its inventory. Yeah, but it has to do more calculations, yes, but that's client side. 
Yeah. And then I prefer just sinking. I prefer not not doing calculations on server. Not, no, no, not calculating it, just but syncing the one value from the client to the server, from the tile entity, and then just adding them up on the on the client. That's like the middle solution of the two, right? It doesn't add any load on the server side, but it makes it also much more efficient on the client side. Cactus fence, gate, dirt, I forgot that one. Okay, torches we got, fence, gate and dirt. Um, we start with that. Some sticks. Here we go. I uh, need more sticks than that though. There we go. And... Giving two more here. Is that enough? Yes, dirt only missing. Yeah, he's napping still. Hey Oliver! Yes, the delivery man generates a message that the warehouse is full. He does that. That is taken care of. Um, just let me already research. Sleep less. No, I wanted to... Block of iron three, don't I? What happened to the three blocks of iron I had with... Ah, I dumped them on the controller, didn't I? Mwah. Meh. Okay. So when we hire one, we have to set it. Um, on level five, it's a chance twice the level of the worker. Okay, no one grown up here yet. Dirt, yes. <laughs> I need dirt. Where do we have dirt? Not on this side. Not on this side. Oh, what happened? Server died. Server died. So let's check out what the crash log is saying of the server. I noticed that it does not always generate a crash log for some reason. Oh, that's weird. Crash reports 2079.25. Yeah, it's that one here. Is it? No, it's not, is it? That one here is from an hour ago, isn't it? Server's time zone might be different. Yeah, but it, uh, it should be in the US, so that one should be my it local. Work fit. 57. 57. 75. Um, that is a silent games. MISC or block activate illegal argument exception. Oh. But from performant? Nah, performant only did the uh, action trigger. Block, eh, block walk action, yes. So that, I guess we have to report to silent games then. Yeah. Um, Wizzy, can you report that to Silent Games? <laughs> he can't hear. Wizzy.
I guess the server should be up again now. Not yet. Short thing. Okay. Almost. We're really close now. <laughs> and <laughs> Orion has the assets, I think, ready already for streaming. Um, I just asked him to late today. I'm going to ask him tomorrow Ooh. morning. And he's going to send it to me tomorrow. I asked him a little bit late today and he was already he already turned off his computer. So tomorrow <laughs> I'm try I'm going to try to remember to remind him tomorrow morning. Yeah, he always goes to sleep at seven or so. Um, when you alter the config for the science and time between, yes, the config is for all raids. So it's the time between the raids they share. The barbarian, pirates, Amazons, Egyptians, all of them share the times together. I don't think he goes off. I think he just turns off his computer and watches some television on the couch. Hello, my. Because he's, he's usually re responsive until a few hours later. A few hours later still. Okay. But he go. I think he goes to, to bed around 10. So he's just hiding. <laughs> just hiding. For me not to bother him. Yes. <laughs> we're, al we're almost back. And I can't, rem I can't forget the dirt. Remind dirt. Okay, we're back. Yes, mind dirt. Mind dirt. dirt. Ray dirt. Ray bad and then ray dirt. Did you get your potatoes too? I have a bunch of potatoes. I gotta check if I need more and new ones. Good night, Schrotaler. <laughs> See you in another stream. See you on the other side, mate. Might? Mm. Get pinged twice. Yeah, Wizzy. Join voice. Yes. Um. So, just where is the dirt? That's the question. And the other one. That one is empty. Good to know. Ah, there we go. Dirt. And now let's check. It was again silk touch. So I gotta mine it. And then I'm going to put this here so that I don't forget what I was up to. Meanwhile, we run over to the builder again. Oh, lost three parrots? That sounds bad. Um. Okay. Dirt, you want it. Dirt, you want it? Weekends again. Oh. And cactus fence and gate? You voided. I have a feeling that's kind of weird. It's, it's so weird. How is this? Happening. Oh, enchanting table go. Oh, I got that. I mind that so that I don't forget. <laughs> I just see it. Said. Why no? Why? <laughs> see ya. I do have a feeling that it happens in between reloading or chunk reloading or something like that. That is the strong feeling I have with that. Yeah, it could be an, a loading issue. 
get some books because I have the strong feeling that some mod is doing some stupid modding with inventories that is causing this oh I need some lapis too I have a strong feeling about that okay piercing good that I don't got a piercing I was I guess my parent would be disappointed I don't want Not that I particularly care about that though. Um, efficiency 4, no. So we're going to mine it again. Place it out here. Enchant the book. Mine it again. Go back inside. Place it down. Fortune 3, yes! Efficiency 4 and Fortune 3. That's a good one. Neat. No, you need unbreaking. <laughs> oh, but that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. It's a silent game one, right? Yes. Yeah, then you can easily repair it. I, I, I'm mining it because this way... Um, I don't have to... Do other ways to get a level one enchantment. I want only a level one enchantment to retry it. And if I don't mine it, uh, I, I only get a level six one. Like you can see here. Uh, other tool, for example, here. The minimum is six, and that costs six levels. But if I mine it, I can do it to uh, get the two levels, basically. Like a little hack. Check for the kids again. Yeah, I've been doing that for a while already. That's a good way. A good way to save a bunch of levels. Oh, nice. Does we want it. Are you sure? I have the experience that it, when I do a, a 6, it costs much more than when I do a 1, though. Um. Okay. Because it's especially strange, because I gave the worker more cactus fence gates than it actually needs. So it doesn't make any sense to lose it, all of it. Right? That would mean that, yeah, that just doesn't make any sense. So the only way that can happen is when actually it gets lost from the rack. And I already have like a feeling that something is meddling with our inventories here. Some mod is derping with that. So we got all stuff here for the shepherd one. So that's good. I mean our inventories do have an additional index on them. On their contents. Where? So we could our our Rex to have a map index. Of ah it. yes. So we could technically compare that with the actual stuff in them. It could actually be that because we I think we used or uh, unsure. Yeah, I can look into that. Let me just write that on my list. Might be a ni a neat way to debug it. Yeah. Rag index. Index difference detection. Okay, I got ready two things. 
my list for tomorrow to check. No, I I checked there was a missing mark dirty in the in the worker, but in the rack there shouldn't be a missing one. No, because it gets it okay. gets synced to the client right right away. Oops. How are children doing by the way? <laughs> so little Wyatt is fine. And little Ray is fine as well. So I hope you guys Yeah, little Ray is fine as long as his, as he has baked potatoes. <laughs> exactly. Um. Having a spawning a parrot with a pirate ship. That's a relatively neat idea. The reason we don't do it is probably because then. Yeah. Could actually be a neat idea to spawn a parrot on the pirate ship. Yeah. There is a place in the pirate ship that is kind of locked in. We don't have a lumberjack either. What the hell? Did all our workers die? Literally all of them. We need to stop killing our workers. We have little Carson here as well. And Carson is becoming our next lumberjack. Yeah, one of them has to become a guard and one of them has to become a researcher as well. Talking about that, I am going to get the three iron blocks to start a research already. I think oh. I can do that. For the shield. Ah. Three iron blocks for that? Yes. <laughs> Expensive. Yeah, it's three bo- Oh wow. Do we have any women in our colony at the moment? Mm, should sure that let me check. Because it's all yeah, it's all boys. Oops, I didn't want to put it here. She wanted to research. We do have one violet, so should be. Okay, shield su usage great. Yeah, only that one builder. Yeah. Mary had a little lamb. Ah, the shepherd is finished. <laughs> I was wondering, what was finished now? Yeah, so many parts of it. Oh, meanwhile, I'm going to turn off hi out to high ring in the, in the shepherd quickly. <laughs> or do we have... I'm probably going to just turn off auto hiring in the colony itself, to be honest. Yeah, for now. We don't have so many huts anyway. Yeah. And later on we can still change the default. Um, yeah. uh, it's, it's manual already. Housing assignment is manual too, by the way. I'm going to make that automatic again. And the tavern two, a violet is now going to work on the cook. Okay. Dun 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 dun. Let me just check. Violet, did she start already? No. I'm going to visit Violet and see what she's going to work on next. She might start. Ah, just started. Great. I'm going to already see what you're going to need, Violet. Sandstone, torch, crafting table, furnace, and a bunch more sandstone. Um, wait. So I got this for the crafting table and a bunch more sandstone. That should be fine. 
Okay, two of this for the crafting table. One of this for furnace. Our second build up still has no build up. Mm -hmm. Did the worker grow up now? No. Yeah, we have all our builders died literally. Sands on the stairs and torches. That doesn't die when we are not, on, not organized. Yes! What the hell? We need more guards so they can't die. I think we need especially more lit places within the corner. Yeah, just block my way! But guards are the, yeah, very few. Sandstone stairs. And there we go. And she just got attacked down here again, by the way. We also need a hospital where they then start automatically going. Torch. Need to get more coal for that. I dumped all my coal. Yeah, I'm going to... Yeah, I could just set up some... some... some doors. For now. It's probably a good idea. Need to get some coal. I'm going to... Eh, make a bunch of doors here. There we go. We get protect our builders. Although they can still fall in here, right? Oh, that's a neat way to make torches. Thanks yeah. for that. Um, okay, let's see. Is it dark down here? I need to place another torch. Here. Just make sure. Yeah, those should be fine. Those should be fine too. general should probably light our colony a little bit better especially the areas around our builder hut because that's probably where a bunch of the mobs are going to yeah I'm using opti not fine I can't see the light levels So I'm just distributing them by my gut feeling. <laughs> Got some more here. This is better. Okay, and we have a second builder. Yay, and I forgot you guys. Welcome Heroicus. Welcome Anonymous564. I did chat with you already though. Welcome Kokolopsis. Lovable Kitsune. Kitsune? I think that one I even pronounced correctly. Kitsune, isn't it? And AVFD Gustin. I'm thinking about making funny nicknames that are so you read some. So I have with a lot of Twitch accounts. <laughs> Just so that I start reading them. The best part is, there's enough people listening to this idea that some may still do it. <laughs> 
<laughs> Someone might randomly still do it, right? <laughs> At least subscribe then. <laughs> Okay. Oh, nice. Also woke up. I woke up, grew up. Grew up, yeah. I'm going to assign him to a guard tower then. Turns out feeding them helps growing them up. <laughs> <laughs> Who had that idea to implement that? Yeah, it's just <laughs> so unrealistic. Oh, what you do what? need a bow. I don't have a bow. I can give you a door though. There you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I hired a guard so that we get a new um, a new citizen. Our oh, builder needs yellow carpet. <laughs> Do I have something, anything? I do have... Is it floating carpet or normal yellow carpet? Oh, both, I think. So, oh, what are you up to? Let me check. And ready is the new yeah, house. 31 yeah. floating on, and 25 normal. Uh, so, what do you need? Certainly yellow though. banner. What do you need right now? Yellow banner. Okay. Just thirteen. Just, just a bunch, right? <laughs> we don't have so much. How many do we need? Does he need thirteen? Yeah, that's sixteen. What do we build next? I have seven. Uh, Eighty-seven. Wood we need. I have seven. I can make you some torches, though. We do have 40 wool in our storage. Do I have anything in wool left in my inventory? Only white wool. But I got a bunch of yellow dye though. And three yellow carpet. Oh, that's why we don't have any new sheep. What Our happened? sheep ate all the grass, and now there's no grass to spread anymore. Du, 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 du. <laughs> there were too many sheep, and they were too fast. But someone told okay. you that that you have to put grass outside of the sheep area. Yeah, so it regenerates. So it can regenerate, right? Regenerate. But some add-ons did not listen, and so the day came where there were no sheep. And what do we yeah, learn from the story? Fault. I didn't do this. <laughs> and what do we learn from the story, kids? Don't be like Sam Adams. Listen to what the adults say. <laughs> we don't have any grass at all anymore. That's bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, <laughs> Carson. He's going to start researching at the university now. Got a lumberjack missing now. Oh, we have a recipe for grass. Is there a recipe for grass? Okay, that's yeah. good. Wheat seeds and... Past. <laughs> no, our Patreons are making fun of us. Of us? No, they're making fun of you. Just, you're just of making me? sure. <laughs> no, no, of you. So placing I think more it was only always you made. The thing. But I can. There should be a balcony. Yeah, the balcony is going to appear the moment the builder is going to finish to go 
go around the farm here. Blazing torches. It's usually a great idea if you don't want your citizens to die too regularly. Um, I need some more sticks. There we go. I think half of them in offhand. Um, the farm is partially underground, yes. But only the farm building, not the farm farm itself. Though. Okay, I'm going sleeping as well. Coming. Ow! Burned my butt. Um. Ah. There we go. I'm not sure if we have a field yet at all, John, to be honest. We have one. We, we have, have a farmer. Yeah, we have a farmer, but do we have... Ah, we do have a farmer worker. Ah, okay. Yeah. So, the, the field is somewhere else. Uh, it's uh, outside, upstairs. So, it is getting fairly late. I'm not even watching the, the time. Um, I've just seen a creeper sneaking up behind the town hall. So, I'm going to get that one solved first. And light up a little bit the area on top of the town hall here. Got some torches now here. Um, Other colony is progressing. We got a bunch of materials in this episode. Um, we got some things upgraded as well. Um. We do have some progress. We got finally a shepherd finished. We got all, all our dead citizen back. Put some torches all around. So I hope until we are going to log in tomorrow, we're not having half of our citizens dead again already. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed the episode today. Thanks everyone for tuning in. If you want to support our project, you can follow, subscribe and become a Patreon. All Patreons get access to the Patreon server we are playing on with all the other existing Patreons. Thanks everyone for tuning in. Have a good night and I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. And thanks Dark Seal Queen for the follow as well. <laughs>